The Sustainable Innovation Forum 2015 was a great launching pad for a number of innovative ideas. Here are some of the best. Carbon Wealth, the company I represent and co-founded, uh, has invented a concept called sky mining. Sky mining is a combination of biology and technology because we need CO2 pumps that extract CO2 from the atmosphere and then we need technology to convert that into a fossil fuel equivalent. The best CO2 pumps in the world are in fast-growing grasses. African grasses to be precise, by planting grass on marginal land which cannot be used for food production. We literally establish trillions of CO2 pumps that take the CO2 out of the atmosphere, put it in the ground. The real innovation though is technology. The technology uh, uses a special nitrogen reactor to drive out most of the oxygen that is in the carbohydrates of grass and turn it into something similar to hydrocarbons. So we're trying to make a copy of fossil fuels but in half an hour instead of 30 million years. Well, the BMW Group is using this platform, the Sustainable Innovation Forum, um, as a platform to showcase BMW i. We have a BMW i3, our all-electric BMW Group electric vehicle on display, and this car is actually a lot more than just an electric vehicle. We have taken with BMW i and with this initiative a very holistic approach and taken a look at every step of the value chain. So that starts with production, uh, that goes into the design of the vehicles, into the usage and also the way we present this car to customers. And ultimately what we've tried to do through the entire life cycle of the BMW i3 vehicle is to reduce the amount of CO2 emissions. So in order to do that, we not only concentrate on using green energy during the usage phase of the BMW i3, but also taking CO2 out of the production process using hydroelectric energy, for example, uh, during the production, or the final assembly and production, which takes place using 100% wind energy. So we're really going to great lengths to reduce the CO2 output by 50% compared to a conventional vehicle. This is EarthWorldSolutions.com. It's an environmental social network. That's the first of its kind. To the individual person is going to have to do things together on their own and with their own friends and with their own teams. And what we're trying to do is create a communication system that anybody in the world can come in and actually get some results, get some advice, team up with people. Certainly business is critical. You've got all kinds of money, you've got all kinds of really good people in business, and they're just trying to figure out how to help too. So what I'm hoping is that there'll become partnerships between the individual people and businesses where they team up. Businesses like, we like what you're doing, let's put some money behind it, let's put some of our management expertise behind it to help you out, and we'll team up and do it. Solar Impulse is showing that clean technologies and renewable energies can achieve the impossible, like flying day and night with no fuel on an airplane. So you imagine an airplane that is 72 meter wingspan, that's bigger than a jumbo jet 747, but it has the weight of a family car. The sun gives enough energy on the photovoltaic cells to run four electrical motors and to load the batteries during the day flight. So it can go on the batteries for the night until the next sunrise and continue. The goal is to be pioneers, to open the door, to show what is feasible with the technologies that use no fuel. Flying laboratory showing the way to use new type of materials and new type of systems to be more energy efficient. And then you have the industry who will take it and do whatever they want to do it in the air. But what we absolutely want is that these technologies would be implemented as soon as possible for cars, for houses, for electrical grids, for industry processes and so on. Because this is where we can divide by two the CO2 emissions with no behavioral sacrifice. And at the contrary, with profit, with job creation. Thanks for watching. For more conversations from the Sustainable Innovation Forum 2015 and other videos about our new economy, please subscribe.